Paul Sweeney at Campus Land School of Rock. Uh, today we've got a request by Michael Collins, a good friend of mine. Um, he's asked for Darlin by Frankie Miller. I don't know where he picked this one for you, to be honest. I think he must be trying to serenade his girlfriend. Um, good on you, mate. Uh, so, this song is quite simple, right? But it's got some fast changes in it. So, the chords we're going to need are G. A D an E minor a C we're also going to use a B C at nine in there just to make it a wee bit simple. Right, so it starts off with a G, right? So down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. Then you go to the D. So that's the bit that's going to give you a bit of bother, probably. Um, so when you do it, G, D, C, G. So we'll do it again, D. And then back up to the G. D, C, G. Right? So that's the first part. Next part is very similar, but it's going to change it in. So we've got G. Then down to D, D again, then it's going to be an E minor, and then you're going to go to C, and then you start, start again. So when you do that, right after the C and the, sort of the E and the C, you need to come back and do the same as you do at the very start of the song, but you don't do it. You only do it once and come back like this. Then it's down to D. Keep on the D. Back up to the G. D, C, G. Then down to D. Stay on that D. And you're going to go to E minor. E minor. That's all it is, right? So it's pretty simple. Um, you just need to get used to the kind of fast movements. Um, one thing is when you're going from the G to D, remember the third finger can stay there, depending on how you play a G. But if you play a G the way I play it, middle finger on three, first finger on two on the A string, then you put your pinky on the bottom and your ring finger just above it on three. So that way you can just then you get a wee anchor finger there. Alright. And the same you're coming back. Even for the C it. Right, I would I would work on getting used to getting used to going from D D C G. What you want to do as well when you're doing the E minor to the C. My middle finger is already, it's already there. Some people might play the E minor like that. I would play it like that, but not for this song because I'm going to unlock it. Like so, E minor, middle finger still there. Just get your ring finger on the third, on the A string, and then put your first finger on the B string. There you go. Just get used to all the simple parts, and the hardest part, like I said, will be that. G, D, C, G, right? And it just goes like that all the way through the song. Pretty simple to sing, if you can sing, I can, so, eh, uh, good on you if you're trying. Um, if you've got any requests, don't forget to pop them in the comments below. Let us know where you're from. Eh, uh, like, 
and don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Uh, hope you enjoyed the lesson. Thanks again.